this is about a doll who is creepy who follows you around. It is not sad in any way. What's that? The crushing burden. The crushing burden of a doll who is creepy and follows you around. It's all, they're all crushing burdens, honestly. Life is a crushing burden. Get used to it. In a town in the woods at the top of a hill, there's a house where no one lives. So you take a big bag of your big city money there and buy it. But at night when the house is dark and you're all alone, there's a noise upstairs. At the top of the stairs, there's a door. So you take a deep breath and try it. And the flashlight shows you something moving just inside the door. There's a tattered dress and a feeling you have felt somewhere before. And there's a creepy guy, and a creepy guy, oh, a doll that always follows you. He's got a ruined eye, his eyes always open. And there's a creepy guy, a creepy doll that always follows you. He's got a pretty mouth, pretty mouth, swallow you whole. So you scream. Downstairs, and you tell yourself it was just a dream. In the morning, you head into town because you want to go antiquing. At the store, there's a strange old man with a wandering eye and a withered hand. As he hands you the old wooden box, you can hear his old bones creaking. And you know what you will find inside the moment that you see that someone's car. So you make some tea, and the doll disapprovingly asks if you really need that much honey. You decide that you had enough, and you lock the doll in the wooden box. Put the box in the fireplace next to your bag of big city money. As the smoke fills up your tiny room, there's nothing you can do. And far too late, you see the one inside the box. Thank <laughs> you.